have you done this yes sir did anyone checked on uh, zidings i have seen the results yashwant any other student who has done it on uh, zidings or any other uh, platform very log platform ever jay sir right so we have completed the verilog htl part verilog htl part for comparator is done 8 bit comparator this is done and also we have done it for a multiplexer also a 2 by 1 multiplexer which is of 8 bit this is also completed and I have asked you to write down the codes for subtractor which is of 8 bit and also I have asked you to look into the very log code first a register which is of 8 bit it should have clock positive edge triggered register it should have a reset it should have some enable it needs to have input and it needs to have output so these are the things that i have told you and i have written a codes for comparator and multiplexer Now suppose if we are writing down the code for a subtractor, eight bit subtractor, the first is you need to know the spec specifications of this subtractor. Specifications are. the set of input variables the subtractor is going to have two input variables a and b where a is of 8 bit and b is also of 8 bit and here we are performing unsigned operation unsigned operations a and b are of 8 bits so this a practice this is a and this is b 8 bit this is also of 8 bit now what will be the result what will be the size of the output result here 8 bit or 9 bit or 10 bit what will be the size it will right right so eight. it can be 8 bit or it can be less than that 8 bit or less than so we will take 8 bit result now it it was said that so the code for the subtractor is to be written in behavioral mode behavior modeling so whenever it is a behavior modeling uh, clear also i have told you that uh, there is no necessity for gate level design no gate level design is not required you need not think of it you need not think of the k maps or you need not think of true table also or you need not think of expressions also these are not required now what is required what is required then algorithm is required algorithm is required algorithm is required right 
Now here the algorithm is straight away. The algorithm for subtraction is output is equal to a minus b. That's it. Output is equal to a minus b. That is output is equal to input one minus input two. That's it. Right. So for this, how do you write the code? Is so it starts with the module, module name, subtractor, eight bit, set of outputs and inputs. Output if it is represented with op, then inputs are in one, in two. The semicolon here. Then after that, the declaration of inputs and outputs. Inputs are declared in this way. I n one, I n two. These are inputs. Output will also be of eight bit. O p. And since I am asked to write down. Behavioral code always at the rate of now. What should be the parameters in the sensitivity list? What should be the variables in the sensitivity list? Input one and input two. Right. Whenever there is a change in input one, or whenever there is a change in input two, we are supposed to calculate the value of output op. Now begin. Right. So here in the always statement, we are using this particular variable, and hence such output is to be declared as reg. Reg seven zero output variable op. Op is equal to a. Sorry, a. Here it is input one, input two. Input one minus input two, and end of module. Then after writing this code, you just verify syntax for this. And after verification of the syntax, you may go for simulation of this. Simulation will be done for checking of input-output relations. It can be done with the help of direct simulators. It can be done with the help of directly. Graphical user interface. So, whenever you are simulating it. So you will be getting a screen in this way. It will come a screen or something. Where here it will be input one, input two, op, and on type. Then you are supposed to give the value of input one. You are supposed to give the value of input two. Then if you run it, you will be getting the output here. Some output. Something like this. Or else you can do it with the help of test bench also. And in the small program, you can use this particular graphical interface. I can never show. Then, if the results are correct, input-output relations are valid. Then synthesis. And synthesis. After synthesis, implementation. After implementation, bit file generation. After the bit file generation, 
FPGA implementation. Now here you you are supposed to create user constraint file. This you will be learning whenever you are uh, do, I mean you, whenever you are doing things on FPGA. Upon matrimo asunde now you cannot create this particular bit file cannot be generated why because it should be connected with FPGA board. Your Xilinx tool must be connected with FPGA board. Uh, so this part is not required now. This part is not required now. You may do it till now, till this part. If you have Xilinx, unte ekal chayech. Right. This is what the subtractor is. The next is after subtractor register. Register. Now this register. The specifications of this register are in this way. This register will have an input, which is of eight bit. It will have an output, which is again of eight bit. It will have a clock signal, a positive edge signal clock, and a reset. In addition to that, it will have some enable also. Enable and reset. Now here. In this particular register, so the input is of what is the size of input here? So input is of eight bit. What about output? This is of eight bit again. What about a reset? One bit. Reset is of one bit. Enable is also one bit. Then we have a clock here. So the clock is nothing but this one. You cannot give uh, one and zero for clock. Clock in your one zero discrete value structure and only you won't get uh, any response. Clock value you cannot give constant values. Me reply the clock is equal to zero. Clock is equal to one. If you give the values in this way, you cannot generate positive edges and negative edges of the clock signals. That won't appear. So clock always should be a continuous stream of zeros and ones. Clock ante ilane ivali. Whereas uh, this values you may give it as a discrete values or you may give in the form of the clock also. Reset ni ilagudi watch keda. I can give in this way, right? Reset. Can we give in this way? Reset value. Yes, sir. Sure. So for this particular duration. Reset will will be equal to one. For this duration, it will be zero. For this duration, it will be one. Here it is zero. Here it is one. So in this way, you can give, or else you can give in this way also. Reset. Allow me to watch with that. Or you may give in this way also. Right. These are the specifications of uh, registers. Now the co code for this is module register eight bit outputs and inputs. Outputs are op. Inputs are in comma clock signal reset signal. Enable signal. Any other inputs and outputs that are left here? You know this, Amma? No, sir. Right. Declare inputs and outputs. Set of inputs are inputs or input. Which keyword is used? Input. Suppose if it is only in. Suppose if it is in and clock and reset and enable. Now tell me which keyword is to be used. 
Are both right. are correct? Right. So this is correct. So kunta mandu untaru. Confuse ava kandi. Sir, okarte unte ikra input three four unte plural gada inputs kara royal sindi and jepesi. So we are not supposed to apply any English grammar over here. Inputs and jepesi kada royal sindi input ani royal. Whether it is the one input or multiple inputs. Input is a keyword. Input. Inputs here are clock. Reset. Enable. And we have also eight bit input which is IN. Seven zero IN. We have output value which is eight bit. Any other variables which are missed here? Have we covered all the variables? Have we covered all the variables? Yes, sir. All right. Now using REG declared the variables which are used in the always loop as outputs. Outputs are used as variables in Matrame REG keyword la describe chain. You need not declare inputs as REG. Now always at the rate of with respect to the clock. Whenever there is a positive edge of the clock, then this loop must ex get executed. Always at the rate of positive edge of the clock begin. If reset, if of reset or if of reset or if reset is equal to one, are these both are same? Is it only same? Ah, yes, sir. This one, this one. Yes, sir. Right, both are same. Yes, sir. Both are same. So if you are not mentioning anything over here, it it is going to take true case. Reset true value then this kuntundi. So it doesn't matter whether you are giving one or not. So if of uh, but for understanding I will be giving here. If reset is equal to one, what will happen to the output amount on the zeros? Do we do we need to consider the value of enable here? Enable aim in the check this call. No, No right. Whenever reset is equal to one, irrespective of the enable value, output must be zero. Whether enable is equal to one or zero, it doesn't matters. Enable value in the matter of the ikkada. Whenever reset is equal to one, straight away output must be equal to zero. Now else, else, if enable is equal to one, if enable is equal to one. Output value is equal to input. Is it true? Is it okay? Will it work properly? Proper ga work chest sunda. So reset. Or else in the sense? Enable zero to start. Enable one, enable one work We are enabling the circuit. We are en ena enabling the circuit. So whenever enable is equal to one, it should work in a normal mode. Whenever enable is equal to zero, disable mode. Enable is equal to one and put normal functioning. The circuit is in enable mode. Enable IP in the work in the normal multiplexer lag or just the register lag or just the decoder lag or just on the enable is equal to one and a put enable is equal to zero and a put disable mode long to the right. You may take it in the uh, another way also. Logic uh, this is also true. If enable is equal to zero, I'll be assuming a normal mode. If enable is equal to one, disable mode. 
active high and active low logic. So here, active low, and this is active high. Both are correct. It depends upon the application. Both are correct, but it depends upon the application, right? Now tell me with respect to this active high enable the base is going either right or wrong. Is it right or wrong? Is it true or not? Else if is it right or wrong? Will it work or not? Yes, sir. Work it. Work out okay. together. You may you may check it. Then and all this loop is ended. And module. And module. See, the, the, there are no rules here. Algorithm ni implement cheyada ki exact ga only one way of programming unto nante. There may be multiple ways of programming. Multiple ways of programming. Ilane raichu if some someone else may write it the same logic in kolagu raichu. There, there are two or three or four ways of executing the same algorithm exist. So the only thing is you need to make sure that whether you are getting the same logic implemented or not. Same logic implemented the chalo. First if rayali, else if rayali, leda if rastanu, else rastanu. It doesn't matter. Logic correctly execute out of the leda chip chess kondi. Simulate it and you need to find out the values. So now I think that it is going to matram or kids. And the parallel in parallel out register. It is parallel in parallel. Okay. Right. Not parallel in parallel. Yes, so here it is parallel in parallel only. Right. So then other steps are to be done. The step one is check syntax. See in check syntax, check syntax has nothing to do with the, the operations and all. Check the slow functionality is away. Check it. Suppose if you are placing here one, and if you are replacing, uh, right, if it is placed here, it has one and the pest pedaman only. Check syntax same to use this. So it shows that it is a proper only. Check syntax will not identify functional errors which are present inside the code. Functional errors ni matram check chayadu. So, if output zero on the other, if output one on the other, check syntax verified and the so yes, it is going to verify only the syntactical errors. Semicolon petara, semicolon pet leda, reg keyword on the leda, always the rate on the leda, open braces, close braces, begin end statement. Avunna leda adi matrame check just sundi. It will not check, it will not check functionality. Functionality in check chayadu. So functionality, you, you will be knowing functionality whenever you are simulating it. Then after that, the simulation to check for input output relations. As I told you, this can be done with the help of the interface which is already available or with the help of the test bench. Whenever you are doing projects, you are supposed to use a test bench. If it is a small example, a laboratory example, then straight away you can give the input values and you can check for the outputs. Right? Simulation is done. After simulation, it is synthesis. After synthesis, it is a design implementation. After design implementation, it is FPGA programming in between fit, uh, bit file generation and all. Then after that, you may check your area, power, these all things can be verified, right? Okay. So what are the things that we have implemented? We have implemented a multiplexer. We have understood a multiplexer, 8-bit multiplexer code is understood. And after that, a register, a register code is written and it is understood. 
comparator 8 bit comparator it is also done then what else we have done the subtractor is done then anything else just parallel and parallel open list right Re register is written here in rasen already 8 bit register yes sir register is written here uh, right now all these blocks all these blocks are going to work based upon the very log code that we have written here right okay now next now how to develop a digital system how to develop a digital system so that is what our subject our subject is digital system design how to develop and design a digital system so th these are not the digital systems a multiplexer register comparator subtractor adder these are not the complete digital systems these are the modules ivanni kuda modules maatrame sub modules maatrame these are only the sub modules these are only part oka part maatrame ivanni kuda these are only the sub modules entire system kaadu multiplexer to entire system untunda can you give any example for that application cheptara only with the help of multiplexer will there be any real time application only with the help of multiplexer only with the help of a register only with the help of comparator only with the help of subtractor if you take a, a, a calculator pocket calculator then any operations untai mobile phone your laptop or a digital watch so uh, these are only sub modules even the sub modules matrame so if you are developing a digital system then how to how to develop it and how to design it with the help of the verilog code that uh, will study a short break for 3 minutes i'll join after 3 minutes possible what are components of a digital system also understand the example so design of design of a gcd system or design of a digital system to calculate design of a digital system to calculate gcd of two numbers two unsigned numbers Two unsigned numbers. Now this is the problem statement. This is the problem statement. Just understanding the problem. So first is uh, what is this all about? Now, what is this GCD? into the what is your city i heard of this is or bcf or scf yes sir what is it it, uh, it is not the greatest common device greatest common device or greatest common factor or the highest common factor 
just common fact. Right. Now tell me how to design a system for this. Right. Whenever it is subtraction, whenever it is subtraction, done simply. A minus B is done. Whenever it is addition, whenever it is addition, simply we have done A plus B. Right. Whenever it is a multiplication, multiply using behavioral code, it can be done in this way. A into B behavioral oper I mean, multiplication IP and the now what about GCD? GCD allows so how to design a subsystem for this. Is there any standard operator for GCD? No, we don't have any standard operator. A GCD B. It will not give any value. Why? Because GCD standard operator M Ledu. Ilanti operator Ledu. We don't have any operator. If there is an operator available, then straight away we can do it. So for that, you need to understand first the algorithm is to be understood first. Algorithm is to be understood. So before that, uh, let me uh, clarify the problem specifications, the design specifications or the problem specifications. Problem or design specifications. So two ones and uh, numbers A, I'll be taking A as an 8-bit number and I'll take B as 8-bit number. A and B as 8-bit numbers. A and B as 8-bit numbers. Now output, the size of the output you may calculate. You may calculate what should be the size of output and you calculate it in the symbol. That's the null data right so it can be maximum 8 bits 8 bits in Dutch now if you don't remember GCD I'll show you I mean I'll give you some examples here now what will be the GCD of 10 and 5 five. greatest common factors five. So the factors for the 10 five are five. yes 5 is the answer what are the factors for the 10 1 2 for 10 2 for 10 two. 5, 10, 1. 1 could out on the other factor? Yes, sir. One. Right. For 5, yes, it will be 1, comma 2, comma 5. Sir, 5 octa 1, 5 octa is a 2. Right, right. 2 will not be there. 2 will not be there. 1 and 5 are the factors for 5. Right. In this, the highest common factor, greatest common divisor, 5. And hence, the answer is 5. Answer is 5. Right. What about GCD of two comma three? One. One out on the. So for one it is one comma two. For three it is one comma three. So the highest common factor is only one. Right. If it is a GCD of one hundred. Comma, uh, comma, twenty-five. What okay. about this? The factors for the hundred are one, two, ten, twenty-five, fifty, and hundred. Four and five takes. Four and five. For twenty-five, the factors are one comma, five comma. 25 so the highest factor is 25 25 will be the answer for this right now what we have done here writing down all the factors writing all factors for a and b then after that finding highest common factor this is what it is done right first of all we are supposed to write all the factors for a and write down all the factors for b 
then after that comparing compare చేసి highest common factor ఏది ఉందో అది ఆన్సర్ అని చెప్పేసి అంటాం is it right yes sir right so this this is one way and then the algorithm one and jp san count now whenever the numbers are large 1000 1000 1500 15000 alone then count how many factors can be there see here so the for for 100 how many factors we obtained 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 eight factors which nine for 100 what about 1000 what about 2000 what about 500 what about 200 so when you say so if we have learned another way also for solving this particular gcd gcd of 10 comma 5 the method which is called as repeated division do you remember this anyone yes repeated <laughs> division right now tell me yes sir both ah సార్ ఆ రెండిట్లో గ్రేటర్ ఏదో చెక్ చేసుకోండి 10 10 తో 5 ని చేయాలా 5 తో 10 ని చేయాలా సర్ 10 ని 5 తో డివైడ్ చేయ ఫస్ట్ వన్ రైట్ ద ఫస్ట్ వన్ ఇస్ రైట్ దెన్ ద సెకండ్ వన్ ఇస్ రాంగ్ సెకండ్ వన్ ఇస్ రాంగ్ సో 5 5 2 ఇట్ ఇస్ 10 రిమైండర్ ఇస్ ఈక్వల్ టు 0 సో ద హైయెస్ట్ కామన్ ఫ్యాక్టర్ ఇస్ ఈక్వల్ టు 5 నౌ ఇఫ్ యు టేక్ ద అనదర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ so gcd of so 20 comma 20 comma 3 20 and 3 ankundam so the first is you need to check which one suppose if the question is given in this way la i will say 3 comma 20 icharu 3 comma 20 now what you will do then greater than la petesi 20 la petesi la chestara 0 point so and so on smallest right okay first we need to find out which, which one is greater whether uh, 3 is greater than 20 or 20 is greater than 3 no 20 is greater 3 now what is this 3 6 18 18 what is the remainder here 2 will be the remainder then 3 will come here 2 ones 2 wipe out on the 3 minus 2 is 1 so 1 2 are 2 this is equal to 0 answer is equal to 1 is it right and then answer is equal to 1 right now another one if it is a gcd of 3 comma 3 3 comma 3 what will be the answer for this 3 sir right do we do we need to perform any operation here malli la veyala 3 3 3 1 are 301 not required right so whenever a and b are equal so the gc is equal to a or b right okay so you under uh, so we have understood we have, or we have seen this gcd can be performed with the help of repeated division repeated division to cheyachu do you all people agree with this do you all agree with this so here now this is called as a quotient and term then and what is this this is called as a divisor and term and what about this dividend dividend what about this remainder and down right right now which one is to be selected as a dividend and which one is to be selected as a divisor greatest one is the dividend smallest one is the divisor right the small one should be taken as a divisor and the larger one should be taken as dividend so it continues right it continues in the further steps right until remainder is equal to zero same thing happens right ప్రతి సారి అంతే అవుతుంది కదా సో హియర్ ఇట్ ఇస్ త్రీ ఇట్ ఇస్ టూ ఇట్ ఇస్ ట్వంటీ ఇట్ ఇస్ త్రీ హియర్ ఇట్ ఇస్ టూ ఇట్ ఇస్ వన్ రైట్ సో సపోజ్ ఇఫ్ దిస్ ఇస్ ఏ అండ్ విత్ బి వాట్ వీఆర్ సపోజ్ టు డూ ఇస్ విత్ వీ ఆర్ సపోజ్ టు చెక్ వెదర్ ఇట్ ఇస్ ఏ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు బి ఆర్ నాట్ వెన్ ఎవర్ ఏ ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు బి వాట్ విల్ హ్యాపెన్ సో ద జిసి ఈక్వల్ టు ఏ ఆర్ ఇట్ ఈక్వల్ టు బి 
and if a is not equal to b a is not equal to b then we are supposed to perform then we are supposed to perform repeated division operation repeated division operation right so the conclusion from this is the conclusion from this is if a is equal to b then gcd is equal to a or b anything can be the value and if else if a is not equal to b a is not equal to b then perform repeated then perform repeated division operation division operation by checking by checking the condition a greater than b or b greater than a by checking this you are supposed to perform repeated division operation until remainder is equal to zero is it true will you agree with this or any doubts any doubts so this we have learned in our uh, primary classes i think lcm gcd hcf gcd and h counter maybe hcf and h counter lc lcm list common multiple right now now what is 10 divided by 2 Five thousand. Five. So the quotient is equal to five. Now, what is twelve divided by three? Right, four. What is twenty divided by two? Ten. Right, right. Okay. What is two multiplied by three? Six, right? So we can perform this operation in this way also, right? Two plus two plus two. इल्ला कुछ ऐड चला? Yes, sir. Three times. This is one. This is two. This is three. Three times ऐड ऐड चला. Suppose if it is three multiplied by five, which is equal to fifteen, it can be done in this way. Three first time, three second time, three third time. Three fourth time and three fifth time. Fifteen. Both are correct, right? Correct, na, Randi Guda. Yes. Yes. So, do you all agree that multiplication can be done with the help of multiplication is nothing but a repeated or iterative addition? Is this right? Okay, yes, sir. Okay, sir. Repeat addition, right? Right. In a similar way, subtraction can be done with the help of. I mean, division can be done with the help of. Division can be done with the help of iterative or repeated subtraction. Chayo chveda. Chayle ma. Chayo sir. Chayo chveda. See this. You can make consider this case. Consider this case, or you may consider this case. If there are twelve apples and three students, three students are there, and three children and conde. Three children. I am supposed to distribute this particular twelve apples to three children. In this, I don't know if the division and it not till you do. First three, 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 three all are structures. Conde. Right, that's it. Three there. So first apple will be given to him. Second apple will be third apple will be given to him. So three apples are pending. Can you know? So twelve, twelve minus three is equal to nine. You know. Then again, I will give first apple to him. 
దెన్ అగైన్ ఫోర్త్ ఆపిల్ ఇక్కడ ఇస్తాను ఫిఫ్త్ ఆపిల్ ఇక్కడ ఇస్తాను సిక్స్త్ ఆపిల్ ఇక్కడ ఇస్తాను నా నైన్ ఆపిల్స్ ఆర్ లెఫ్ట్ త్రీ ఆపిల్స్ నేను ఇచ్చేస్తాను వాళ్ళందరికి సిక్స్ వచ్చేస్తుంది నా సిక్స్ ఆపిల్స్ ఆర్ దే దిస్ ఇస్ సెవెన్ దిస్ ఇస్ ఎయిట్ దిస్ ఇస్ నైన్ సిక్స్ త్రీ డిస్ట్రిబ్యూట్ చేస్తా అండ్ నా త్రీ ఆపిల్స్ ఆర్ దే so this is 10 this is 11 three apples are there three apples will be distributed for three and i'll be left with zero how many times this iteration went on a repetition and any sal jarigindi this is the first okay. time this is the second time this is the third time this is the fourth time and hence the answer is four is it okay any doubts in this we are we are counting the number of iterations here number of iterations count yes no number of iterations number of repetitions any sal repeat and any sal manam ichcham so four times repeat ayindante we have given him four apples five times repeat ayindante five apples ichinattu now right 12 idi sarpindi 3 4 that 12 remainder zero suppose if it is the same 12 apples సార్ ఈ కేసుకి మరి ఎలా ఫైండ్ అవుట్ చేస్తారు ఇఫ్ దెర్ ఆర్ ఫైవ్ చిల్డ్రన్ హౌ డి యూ సాల్వ్ దిస్ ఇది ఎలా చేస్తారు ఫైవ్ ఫైవ్ చేసి మిగిలిన ఇంత రిమైండర్ గా ఉంటుంది రైట్ దట్ సెట్ సో ద ఫైవ్ చిల్డ్రన్ విల్ బి దేర్ సో ద ఫస్ట్ సెకండ్ థర్డ్ ఫోర్త్ ఫిఫ్త్ ఫస్ట్ రౌండ్ సో 12 12 5 is equal to 7 నా దగ్గర సెవెన్ ఆపిల్స్ ఉన్నాయి నా సెవెన్ ఆపిల్స్ అగైన్ ఐ విల్ గివ్ ఫర్ ఆల్ ద మెంబర్స్ సో సిక్స్ సెవెన్ ఎయిట్ నైన్ టెన్ రైట్ సెవెన్ మైనస్ ఫైవ్ ఇస్ ఈక్వల్ టు టూ నో ఐఎమ్ లెఫ్ట్ విత్ టూ ఆపిల్స్ ఐ కెన్ నాట్ గివ్ టూ ఆపిల్స్ ఫర్ ఆల్ ద ఫైవ్ మెంబర్స్ దీన్ని మళ్ళీ డివైడ్ చేసి పార్షల్ ఐ మీన్ పార్టిషన్స్ అలాంటివి ఏం లేదు సో ఐఎమ్ లెఫ్ట్ విత్ టూ ఆపిల్స్ దిస్ ఇస్ మై రిమైండర్ and the number of iterations here are two iterations sarpenda this is the quotient and the remainder left out thing is nothing but the remainder number of iterations is equal to quotient and left left out value is equal to remainder any doubts any doubts for anyone a simple logic ante ante min chain ledu it, it is applicable for any number it is applicable for any number you can divide 100 with 100 with 25 or divide 100 with 30 divide 100 with 30 100 minus 30 is equal to what will be the answer 670 సెవెంటీ remainder is equal to 10 is it right is it correct yes sir right any doubts for anyone in this right based upon this so your final conclusion is our final conclusion is our final conclusion on gcd if a is equal to b so my gcd will be equal to a or it can be equal to b and if a not equal to b then calculate or perform perform 
repeated subtraction subtraction repeated subtraction perform cheyandi ani cheppes antadu and this is clearly mentioned with the help of an algorithm euclid's gcd algorithm euclid's gcd algorithm now what is this euclid's gcd algorithm and enti euclid's gcd algorithm right gcd of Twenty comma three, three comma twenty. Now, what is the answer for this? What is the GCD of three comma twenty? Three, ah? One, one. Right, it is only one. It is only one, one. Right. Now, how he has done is, Euclid's algorithm says that, assume that one variable. so these these are two variables a comma b two variables ankonde so a is nothing but 3 and b is equal to 20 now the first is step 1 step 1 check for equality of a and b check for a equal to b case whether a equal to b or not if it is uh, true If a is equal to b, then G C D is equal to a. G C D is equal to a. Now tell me here, is three equal to twenty? Out in the right. Yeah. This is false. This is false. Then we are supposed to perform some repeated subtraction operation. Then perform repeated. subtraction operation perform cheyali right now how to perform this this is the value of a and this is the value of b now what is the value of a initial value em undi what is the initial value of a is 3 now what is the initial value of b it is 20 20 the first case anedi fail ayipindi a is not equal to b ayipindi then it says that if a is not equal to b then exist two cases a not equal to b under two cases avochu it can be a greater than b avochu Or it can be a less than b. Will there be any other case? In case one on thunda, right? So if it is a not equal to b, it should be either a greater than b or wali or a less than b. Now if it is a greater than b, then the new value of a will be see new value. The new now the new value of a will be. new value of a will be a minus b and the new value of b will be simply b itself and if it is a less than b then my new value of a will be a only and new value of b is equal to b minus a is it clear is it clear yes sir right then again after getting this particular things then again you check for whether a not equal to b or a equal to b if it is a not equal to b again check whether it is a greater than b or it is a less than b the same thing happens again if it is a greater than b the new value of a is equal to a minus b avutundi now here we have obtained the values of a and b 
here we are supposed to check whether it is a not equal to b or not then again it is a greater than b or a less than b or if this is true sir ante ok sari unequal aithe malli manam subtract chesina unequal avaga sir sub right uh, i'll show you how, how it happens come on three piece kondu right and which is an example this one done with the help of example i'll be explaining you right so in this way here again a less than b a greater than b so if it is a greater than b again a a value will be equal to a minus b b value will be equal to b here it is a value will be equal to a b value is equal to b minus a so in in this way the process repeats in this way the process repeats until until a is equal to b until a is equal to b appudu varaku avutundo akkada varaku repeat avutundi then whenever whenever a is equal to b then the gcd value is equal to a right we'll see this with the help of a small example uh, example is already written above gcd of this is 3 comma 20 3 comma 20 right a is equal to 3 b is equal to 20 case one check for a equal to b or not a equal to b outna avatle la check cheyandi 3 equal to 20 is it true or false false right this is false then you are supposed to move to case 2 or step 2 or case 2 whatever it may be step 1 step 2 on this one this is step 1 right step 2 is check first a greater than b or not a greater than b or a less than b idi check cheyandi em aitundi what is happening a less than b right so here it is a is less than b since a is equal to 3 b is equal to 20 right after this step 3 step 3 and a new value of new value of a will be equal to a itself and b will be equal to b minus a what is the new value of a here please 3 what is the new value of b 20 minus 3 and then this is 17 right 17 kada yes sir right now step 4 again check whether it is a equal to b or not a equal to b condition check cheyandi 3 is not equal to 17 we may go for step 5 what is step 5 the check for a greater than b or a less than b now what is here what is the case here a greater than b or a less than b a less than b right a less than b here a is less than b the reason is a, the value of a is 3 and the value of b is equal to 17 now step 6 new value of a new value of a will be equal to 3 new value of b will be equal to 17 minus 3 which is equal to 14 14 now step 7 step 7 again check whether it is a equal to b or not it, it says that 3 is not equal to 14 now i'll be going for the step 8 check for a greater than b or a less than b 
So here again it is A less than B only. 3 is less than 14. Step 9. What is the new value of A? New value of A is equal to 3. What will be the new value of B? 14 11. minus 3 which is equal to 11. So 3 and 11 are the values now. Now step 10 is compare or check A equal to B condition. So 3 is not equal to 11. So perform, repeat your operation. Repeat operation. Step 11. It says that check for A greater than B or A less than B. A greater than B or A less than B check chain. So here it is A is less than B. The 3 is less than 11. Now step 12. It says that the new values of A. What is the new value of A? Is 3. What will the new value of B A Motun? 3 minus 11, sorry, 11 minus 3. What is 11 minus 3? 8, sir. Right, 8. Step 13. Again, check whether A equal to B or not. So here it is 3 not equal to 8. So go for the next step. Go for step 14. Step 14 is check whether it is A greater than B or A less than B. So here it is again. A less than B only. 3 is less than 8. 3 is less than 8. Step 15. The new value of A is equal to 3. The new value of B is equal to 8 minus 3, which is equal to 5. That is, A is equal to 3. B is equal to 5. Step 16. Step 16. Check A equal to B or not. 3 is not equal to 5. 3 is not equal to 5. Step 17. Check for A less than B or A greater than B. A less than B or A greater than B. So here it is. A is less than B since 3 is less than 5. Since 3 is less than 5. Now step 19. Sorry, step, step 18. The new value of A. New value of A is equal to 3. New value of B is equal to. What is the new value of B here? 5 minus 3. 2. 5 minus 3 is 2. So A is equal to 3. B is equal to 2. A is equal to 3. B is equal to 2. Right. So step 19. Check whether it is A equal to B or not. So 3 is not equal to 2. 3 is not equal to 2. Step 20. Check whether it is A greater than B or A less than B. Now tell me what is the case here. A greater than B or A less than B? A greater than B. Right. A greater than B. 3 is greater than 2. 3 is greater than 2. Step 21. Now the new value of A. The new value of A is A equal to A eight. minus B. Right. So this is 3 minus 2, which is equal to 1. Now B is equal to B, which is equal to 2. So A is equal to 1. And B is equal to 2. And again continuous process continues now check for a equal to b or not so one is not equal to two and hence 
next step is check for a less than b or a greater than b so here a is less than b since one is less than two step 24 and new values of a what is a value is one itself a equals to one, b, equals b is equal to so two minus two. one is equal to one a is equal to one and b is equal to one Now step 25, check for A equal to B or not. So 1 is equal to 1. This is true. And hence GCD is equal to A, which is equal to 1. Right. Another example. GCD of n comma five. GCD of n comma five. A is equal to ten. B is equal to five. Now step one is step one. Check for A equal to B or not. So ten is not equal to five. So we are supposed to go for step two. Check whether it is a greater than b or a less than b. So here it says greater than b since 10 is greater than 5. Now step 3. A new value of a is equal to a minus b. New value of b is equal to b. This is equal to 10 minus 5 which is equal to 5. New value of b is equal to 5. So A is equal to 5 and B is equal to 5. Now step 4 says that I check for A equal to B condition. 5 is equal to 5. So GCD is equal to 5. Is it clear? So 5 is equal to 5. All right, 5 is equal to 5. Five is equal to five. GCD is equal to five. So from above, tell me what is happening. See, are there equality any steps condition that are repetitive steps? Same on on repeat out on step same on. Yes, sir. Comparison step same on repeat out on. See, this is a first step. A is equal to B. This is second step. It ain't the third step out on the new value of a is equal to a minus a a minus b or b minus a then this is fourth step now i'll say in that so instead of this fourth step why can't we direct uh, loop if chessy it could be a chair the money then Checking IP and so again checking for a equal to b, a greater than b or a less than b IP and so if it is a, a less than b, this will take place. If it is a greater than b, some other step will be taking place. So how many steps will be there? Four steps are put together. Four steps are sufficient, right? Four steps sufficient, Gada. Step one is comparison for not e equality case. Now step two is for greater than or less than case. Now step three, if A greater than B, then it is A is equal to A minus B, B is equal to B. If it is A less than B, so A is equal to A, B is equal to B minus A. Then after that, so we'll be getting the new values of A and B. Again, go for step one. 
इधर आया श्वेता Is it true? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Can we write in this way? Ila na yach kida? Right. So while why a not equal to b while a not equal to b enter into this particular loop if if A is greater than B. The next value of A is equal to A minus B. Next value of B is equal to B. Else, else in the sense this is else if A less than B in a pool. If it is A less than B, then A is equal to A, B is equal to B minus A. Display the value of a. Ah, uh, is this same? Correct, yes. Nadi. Is this code correct? While a not equal to b, loop repeat type of count on the and uh, the value of a and b gets updated. A not equal to b in a pro, so either this should be positive. Ah, uh, do what correct a vali, and hence the values of a and b gets ah uh, the uh, changed. अपडेटेड अवत अपडेट अवता है ए वालूस अं बी वालूस गेट अपडेटेड वेन एवर एज ईक्वल टू बी एपड़ वेन एवर एज ईक्वल टू बी एपड़ो दे कम अवट आफ द लूप कम अवट आफ द लूप एंड डिस्प्ले द वालू आफ ए आर यू कैन रईट इट डिस्प्ले द वालू आफ बी अंतना इज इट ट्रू इज इट रईट इज दिस ओके इज दिस अलगार्थम ओके जीरो की अंटे ये और भी है तो जीरो उन्ना पूरा वाइल्ड राइट आप तेल्स पूर्त नहीं करता ये नॉट इक्वल टू बी केस के उसको नहीं करता सपोज़ इफ़ ए इज़ इक्वल टू फाइव सपोज़ इफ़ ये जीरो है तो जी सी डिक्कर सपोज़ इफ़ ए इज़ इक्वल टू फाइव एंड बी इज़ इक्वल टू जीरो आप रेम होते नहीं करंटे जीसीडी जीरो तो कोर्स दो रखते हैं। राइट ऑन। इफ वी कैन नॉट डू इट राइट। राइट। सो हियर वी कैन आई मीन वी कैन सेट ओ कंडीशन राज। कंडीशन सप्लाई। राइट। सो वी कैन नॉट डू इट राइट। ओके जीरो ओके फाइव ए पुत्र जीरो फाइव जा जीरो जीरो एम रस। We can uh, keep a line there. While a not equal to zero and b not equal to zero condition, right? Right, that's better. That can be written. Right. So this is this is what. So this is my algorithm. So last and final question and under this is my conclusion. So I'll be doing my GCD in this way. Ila jastan. In this way. Now. Now what is happening in this so comparison is happening here. Comparison in the sense we require a comparator. We require a comparator. Subtraction is taking place. We need a subtractor. Subtractor. Then see this. Now what is this? A claim or some? Now what is this? I have written here. End of the register. Initial and last one. Then whenever this is getting updated, the value will be written. Raw like that. Updated value. Now which value is updated to be taken? Value. Whether I am supposed to take initial value this call or updated value this call, which one is to be taken? Updated. Updated. 
అవి ఇనిషియల్ వాల్యూ లోడ్ అవ్వకుంటే అప్డేట్ వాల్యూ ఎలా వస్తుంది ఇనిషియల్లీ ఐ యామ్ సపోజ్ సర్ దానికి పారామీటర్స్ యూస్ చేసుకొని సి ఇఫ్ ఐ యామ్ టేకింగ్ రిజిస్టర్ వాల్యూ ఇది ఒక రిజిస్టర్ ఏ ఉంది ఇక్కడ రిజిస్టర్ బి ఉంది సో ద ఫస్ట్ వాట్ ఐ యామ్ సపోజ్ టు టే డు ఇస్ ఐ విల్ బి ఎంటరింగ్ అవుట్పుట్ వాల్యూ సో ఇక్కడ 3 ఇస్తున్నాను then after that uh, so i am giving the another value as 20 then after that some operations will be taking place here edo operations avtai operations ayipin tarvata another value will be coming updated value ostundi ee updated value ni ekkala load chestam can we load in this way two inputs untaya serial output la chesanu separate serial input serial output register lo manam loading ko matru vaadu right సో ప్యాలల్ ఇన్పుట్ సీరియల్ అవుట్పుట్ రిజిస్టర్ అది తీసుకోవాలి ప్యాలల్ ఇన్పుట్ సీరియల్ అవుట్పుట్ రిజిస్టర్ తీసుకుంటే నాకు ఫోర్ క్లాక్ సైకిల్స్ ఎయిట్ క్లాక్ సైకిల్స్ ఇంక్రీజ్ అవుతాయి కదా రైట్ వాట్ షుడ్ బి డన్ హియర్ టెల్ మీ సో టూ ఇన్పుట్స్ మనం ఇవ్వగలమా రిజిస్టర్ రైట్ యు ప్లేస్ ఎ స్మాల్ మల్టీప్లెక్సర్ దట్ ఈస్ సఫిషియంట్ ఇక్కడ మల్టీప్లెక్సర్ పెట్టండి టూ బై వన్ మల్టీప్లెక్సర్ ఇస్ ఇట్ క్లియర్ ఫర్ ఆల్ a 2 by 1 multiplexer pettandi so whenever the initial value is giving so set selection is equal to 0 selection is equal to 0 initial value selection is equal to 1 updated value then will there be any problem appu load cheyochu kada depending upon your requirement hello అప్పుడు కూడా ఒక క్లాక్ పల్స్ కి ఉంచుకోవాలి కదా సార్ నా క్లాక్ పల్స్ గురించి తర్వాత మాట్లాడదాం ఆ రిజిస్టర్ క్లాక్ పల్స్ సెట్ లా వారీ అవుతాయో సో బట్ ఫస్ట్ క్లాక్ పల్స్ లో ఇది వచ్చింది అనుకుందాం ఇనిషియల్ వాల్యూ వచ్చేసింది సెకండ్ క్లాక్ పల్స్ లో వి విల్ బి టేకింగ్ ది అనదర్ వాల్యూ అప్డేటెడ్ వాల్యూ సెకండ్ క్లాక్ పల్స్ ఆర్ థర్డ్ క్లాక్ పల్స్ లో వచ్చేస్తుంది ఆఫ్టర్ ఆల్ దోస్ పర్టిక్యులర్ అప్డేషన్ హస్ టేకన్ ప్లేస్ a is equal to a minus b b is equal to b or a is equal to a b is equal to b minus a అవన్నీ ఆపరేషన్స్ అయిపోయిన తర్వాత after second clock cycle or after a couple of clock cycles selection value ni nen change chestha i will make selection value 1 and i load updated value updated value load chestha same register can you do that in that way right so selection of or we can say here క్లాక్ లేకుండా అలా చేస్తాం రిజిస్టర్ వచ్చింది వెన్ ఎవర్ ద రిజిస్టర్ కమ్స్ ఇన్ టు ద పిక్చర్ సో వెన్ యూ రిక్వైర్ క్లాక్ రిజిస్టర్ వచ్చింది అంటే క్లాక్ కావాలి లోడ్ విన్ ఇట్ రిమెంబర్ దట్ వాల్యూస్ రిమెంబర్ చేసుకోవాలి కదా ఏఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఏ అని చెప్పేసి ఎట్లా తెలుస్తుంది ద ప్రీవియస్ వాల్యూ రైట్ ఏఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఏ యువర్ కాంబినేషన్ తోటి అవ్వదు కదా కాంబినేషన్ అవ్వదు ప్యూర్ కాంబినేషన్ అవ్వదు అప్డేట్ అవుతా ఉండాలి వాల్యూస్ ఏ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఏ బి ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు బి మైనస్ ఏ ఆర్ ఏ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఏ మైనస్ బి బి ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు బి సో బేస్డ్ ఆఫ్ పాస్ట్ వాల్యూస్ ని బేస్ చేసుకుని అప్డేట్ అవుతా ఉండాలి సో వీ నీడ్ టు యూస్ రిజిస్టర్స్ పాస్ట్ వాల్యూస్ అప్డేట్ అవ్వాలంటే రిజిస్టర్ నాకు కావాలి పాస్ట్ వాల్యూ గుర్తు పెట్టుకోవాలి అంటే అంటే విర్లా కోడ్ విర్లా కోడ్ కి ఆఫర్ లేదు విర్లా కోడ్ లో కూడా రిజిస్టర్స్ కావాలి కదా వెరీలా కోడ్ లో కూడా రిజిస్టర్స్ కావాలి కదా హౌ యూ ఆర్ పర్ఫార్మింగ్ కౌంటర్స్ కౌంటర్ ఎట్లా వచ్చేస్తుంది కౌంటర్స్ లో రిజిస్టర్స్ రాలేదా కౌంట్ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు కౌంట్ ప్లస్ వన్ రాసాము బట్ వెన్ ఇఫ్ యూ సీ ద ఆర్టిఎల్ డయాగ్రామ్ సో దెర్ దెర్ విల్ బి ఫ్లెట్ ఫ్లాప్స్ ఉంటాయి డీ ఫ్లెట్ ఫ్లాప్స్ ఉంటాయి కౌంట్ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు కౌంట్ ప్లస్ వన్ ఇఫ్ యూ ఆర్ రైటింగ్ ఇన్ దట్ వే ఇట్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఎ కాంబినేషన్ లాజిక్ కౌంట్ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు కౌంట్ ప్లస్ వన్ అంటే డెఫినెట్లీ దెర్ విల్ బి డీ ఫ్లెట్ ఫ్లాప్స్ ఇన్ దట్ or definitely there will be t flip flops in that flip flops untai yes sir memory undi ante registers raavali registers vachay ante clock untundi right so loading of initial value or loading of updated value a theesukovali multiplexer will decide multiplexer will decide now the next thing is storing the past values and the present values for which i require a register do you require any other elements the elements kaakunda inkem elements kavala signals gurinchi matladaledu elements gurinchi matladutunnanu blocks gurinchi matladutunnanu 
do we require any other blocks any other elements inke emanna kavala ee logic implement cheyali ante sir input decimal estam ga sir sorry decode cheyali ga sir binary decode cheyali right now here we are speaking only of decimal values and put them decimal values sort of operate out than kunnam no have you performed addition operation perform jesa va or or have you written a code for uh, magnitude comparator comparator rasa va i have asked you to write a code for subtraction right a minus b raya manna we have discussed a comparator also for a comma b it chusa va idi or have you understood this hello yes sir yes sir now have you understood this comparator rhythm in the very law code lo comparator raste ela execute avutundi em jarugutundi adantha you once go through those basics again i'll just choose konali right so elements that are required here are comparator is required subtractor is required multiplexer is required register is required any other blocks that are required to implement this particular while loop the while loop implement cheyalante ink emanna kavala comparator subtractor multiplexer register apart from that do you require any other elements any other blocks ink emanna kavala no sir so if it is no can uh, then can we draw the diagram for this diagram draw it cha can we draw a diagram for this draw it and i will be giving you 5 minutes time implement a diagram for implementation of this particular while loop while of a not equal to b If a greater than b, the values of a and b are written. If a less than b, another values. Draw it, and I'll be giving you five minutes time. I'll be seeing that message. You may send a message if you have done it. Chandu has done it. Prasad, Shushant, done it. Anjane, Lu. no one from this group yogananda ajay sharma rajeshwari devi prashant shailaja now from this link no one has done the pavan varalakshmi pavan bandi from this link anjaneelu has done it only one person only anjaney do yashwant has done it second person any other person this rearrangement of multiplexers register comparator subtractor have you more proper ga arrange chese saripothundi nothing you, may, you you are supposed to do it's not a big design 
proper arrangement of multiplexer comparator register subtractor those four things right so we'll go here snuff no let it be a register a check your answers whether it is same or not a register b whenever there are registers there will be clock signals please mute your mics mute your mic now what i have told you is from this particular in, into this particular register register we may enter the new value or we may enter updated value so we may enter new value or we may enter updated value here i'll be placing max this is input a this is the initial input of b then what should be updated value same over watch updated values updated value same over wali subtractor nu chocha output right subtractor i'll place a subtractor here I'll place another subtractor here. This subtractor is for a minus b. And this is for b minus a. Now, where is the those values? Where are those values? I can use this one down. Yeah, in between. Right. in a in b this call updated values is call updated values the subtractor in a in b teesukunte alla daniki inko marks use chey right so we are we will be taking the updated values sir compare comparison cheyali sir Compare is to be done. Okay, only the comparison. We'll, we'll draw that also. Comparison, I have subtract. Ah, oh, okay. We'll do that. Just ma'am, update yes, ma'am. The values of A and B.
is it okay subtractor kuda comparator yokka output enable gaya vachu let us do it let me explain here suppose if a is equal to 10 and b is equal to 4 now what is the answer for this 24 gcd answer uh, what will be the gcd value 2 sir right two is answer for this let, let us observe what will happen here first is 10 is equal to initial values are 10 and 4 this is not the initial value initial value is written here right now what about multiplexer multiplexer ki inga edanna untunda line em anna untunda selection line right. selection selection a ankonde and about uh, this is selection b right the first thing is whenever you are giving the input values the first uh, value that should be known is what should be the value of selection a em avvali zero sir and selection, selection a is selection b rendu zero right okay this is zero and this is zero fine so i am making this as zero and this is also made as zero and hence the multiplexer output will be so this is equal to 10 and the value of this is equal to 4 is it right correct enary is it clear for everyone so what about register value register value register will have the clock signal untundi register value will be having uh, enable value register will be having reset all these things will be there now let me do it here let me do it let enable value is equal to what should be the value of, of enable what should be the value of the clock signal what should what about reset is one, one name one only zero. right one enable one value zero. must be one the clock value positive edge reset value must be zero maybe three avali right i have done it avan chesan ankondi and the register value is 10 here and register value is 4 here perfect now the comparator inputs is one is 10 and the other one is 4 right now what about the outputs cheppandi motha comparator outputs 100 so a greater than b this is 1 this is 0 this is 0 is it clear uh, are you following this everyone yes sir 100 ipn 100 right now what is the updated value of a ikkada updated value em ochundi a di this is 10 sir as a comparator operation perform cheyaledu see we haven't done anything man em cheyaledu inga comparator di adantha em cheyaledu just we are passing the values that's it ikka 10 4 undi alage and here the value of b is 4 the value of a is 10 so 10 minus 4 the value is 6 over here and 4 minus 10 the value is minus 6 suppose it is minus 6 ochind ankonde minus 6 ochind right now the comparator says that the comparator says that a is greater than b and j plus antundi a is greater than b now whenever a greater than b what should be the new value of a and what should be the new value of b a new value m minus b a minus b b a minus right this is b right now how to load this values a is equal to a minus b b is equal to b ela avutundi the subtractor ki enable ga that when the selection line ni comparator right now what i'll do here is a is equal to a minus b avali that that is i want this value to appear here and b is equal to b itself this should not get updated id inka na update avadaniki ledu id inka update avadaniki ledu right now two things can be done here now this can be controlled with the help of selection lines it can be controlled with the help of selection lines so control cheyachu or else i can control with the help of enable also ante na can i do it yes sir two ways to cheyachu kada sir ante కంప్రెటర్ అవుట్పుట్ ఏదో ఒకటి వచ్చినప్పుడు ఏదో ఒక సబ్ స్ట్రక్చర్ మాత్రమే వర్క్ లో ఉండాలి కదా సార్ అని అదే చెప్తున్నా ఐ మీన్ వి కెన్ ఆల్సో డు దట్ ఆల్సో వి కెన్ 
హ్యావ్ వన్ మోర్ సబ్ట్రాక్టర్ ఎనేబుల్ అని కూడా పెట్టుకోవచ్చు సబ్ట్రాక్టర్ ఎనేబుల్ అని పెట్టుకొని డిపెండింగ్ అపాన్ ద కంట్రోల్ ఐ మీన్ ద కంపరేటర్ అవుట్పుట్ వీ కెన్ ఆన్ దిస్ ఆర్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ అది కూడా చేసుకోవచ్చు బట్ సపోజ్ దట్ ఈస్ నాట్ దేర్ అది లేదు అనుకోండి అది లేదు సో దిస్ ఇస్ ద డిజైన్ నా వాట్ ఆర్ ద పాసిబిలిటీస్ అది నాకు చెప్పండి సబ్ట్రాక్టర్ కి ఎనేబుల్ ఏం లేదు we are using a simple subtractor simple subtractor chestam sir apu selection ni one pettukoni selection bit zero pettukunta idi right that is one particular option inko option enti register tho control cheyalama with the help of register suppose if if i am making this ante enable off chesochu see this adu ayipindi i mean uh, the inputs are loaded one once inputs are loaded i'll make this selection value as 1 and i'll make this selection value as also 1 ee rendini van chesesa nenu uniform ga only initial ga unnappudu maatrame selection is equal to 0 once that particular initial work is done i have made selection value as 1 chesesa inka then here what happened is so 6 has come here and here it is minus 6 ochindi now what i am saying is can't you control the values of a and b with the help of register enables to control jailera meeru here we have enable reset ivanni unnai now what i'll do is what i'll do is simply i will make this enable is equal to 1 and i'll make this enable as 0 clock signal chesan enable 1 enable 0 pettanu chesan now tell me what will be the new value of this ఇక్కడ ఏమవుతుంది అది ప్రీవియస్ స్టేట్ ఉంటుంది కదా సర్ బి రీసెట్ ఇస్ ఈక్వల్ టు 0 స్టిల్ రీసెట్ ఇస్ ఈక్వల్ టు 0 రీసెట్ ని టచ్ చేయట్లా సో దిస్ వాల్యూ విల్ బి ఇస్ ఈక్వల్ టు 6 క్లాక్ సిగ్నల్ ఇస్ गिवन 6 వాట్ అబౌట్ దిస్ ద ప్రీవియస్ వాల్యూ ఇక్కడ 4 ఏ ఉంటుంది రైట్ వచ్చేసింది కదా దిస్ ఇస్ అనదర్ వే ఇట్ కెన్ బి కంట్రోల్డ్ విత్ ద హెల్ప్ ఐ మీన్ దిస్ కెన్ బి డన్ విత్ ద హెల్ప్ ఆఫ్ ఎనేబుల్ అక్రాస్ సబ్ట్రాక్టర్ ఆర్ విత్ ద హెల్ప్ ఆఫ్ సెలెక్షన్ and lines or with the help of enable across register a and register b three ways to do it everything is correct or wrong i mean we cannot say something is wrong now the values of this is this is equal to 6 here and this is equal to 4 now tell me what will be the output values of this this will be again this will be 1 this will be 0 and this will be 0 this is 6 this is 4 this is 4 this is 6 and the value of this is 6 minus 4 is 2 and the value of this is minus 2 i am keeping the same selection values selection values are not changed and hence i'll be getting the value here 2 and i'll get the value here as minus 2 2 was in the minus 2 was in the now with the help of enable values i'll make this enable as 1 i'll make this enable as 0 and hence this value will be equal to 2 this value will be equal to 4 is it clear for everyone this is 2 this is 4 is it clear partially is it clear completely you'll be understanding it later so somewhat right so whenever it is 2 is 4 then what will happen this is equal to 0 this is equal to 0 and this is equal to 1 a is less than b the right. two four values are passed here this is equal to 2 this is equal to 4 this is equal to 4 this is equal to 2 so in here i'll be getting minus 2 and here i'll be getting a plus 2 the selection lines are made as ones only so and hence this value will be minus 2 here and this value will be plus 2 here and now what should be the enable values enable Zero first one. block aim of all the second block right perfect so the first value enable here this enable value must be 0 and this enable value must be 1 right whenever this enable value is equal to 0 the same 2 and is continue ipothundi and here what will happen is the new value will be entering here what the value is in the two now 
the new values are this is 2 and this is 2 2 and 2 now this is 0 this is 1 and this is 0 a is equal to b a is equal to b now you place another register here in go register this kind of register for output now enable this particular register with the help of enable this particular register okay. with the help of equality condition the clock condition laga untundi reset untundi and this is output whenever this is equality output will be equal to 2 right now see this less than greater than kuda ab reach to ab ki cheyochu less than greater than kuda register ab scannable ga ichukochu control cheyochu right ivali ivali that, that is what i will tell you see this so if if you are comp if we draw a simple block diagram for the above tell me the set of inputs and set of outputs na cheppandi what are the set of inputs ab is another one input which is of 8 bit ankondi now b is another input which is of 8 bit a clock signal me you sir and output any other values in given values call a block selection and right so we are supposed to give the selection for a multiplexer a we are supposed to give the selection for a multiplexer b any other values enable sir we are supposed to give the enable val a for register Re, enable for register b enable for output register any other values get wala reset reset any other values any other values i think we have covered all the values clock is also written right now how you are going to give this values ee values ela istar selection a ela istaru selection b ela istaru enable value a enable value b sir local blocks so puts the connection out values right now for that what you are supposed to do is the operator to generate e one ni kuda generate cheyali you want to generate jali and now how you will be generating those things it depends upon generation of this depends upon comparator outputs comparator outputs ni base cheskoni the selection a selection b enable value enable b those values will be generated all this or uh, this values constant values i want ni kuda No, sir. no sir. constant values are vary so it varies right it varies according to the comparator outputs they are going to vary and hence you cannot give a constant values so that particular circuit has to be designed overall it looks in this way the overall circuit looks in this way i will be finishing the class in the next 3 uh, 4 minutes we are giving a here and also b is given a b are given now what are the outputs that are generated here outputs are a greater than b a equal to b a less than b these are the outputs that are generated this outputs i will be giving for one particular block and from this block i am going to generate selection underscore a selection underscore b enable a enable b 
enable B. Then after that, Gamuna enable yeah. for out. The clock signal is to be given directly for this clock signal for this also. Reset. Reset signal. Right. Now what will happen is, so this particular outputs which are generated here. Are connected to this. Ravimali comparator case, Tamu sir. Comparator ke ban. Comparator ke andar kis sam? Selection ye deni kis sam? Sir, ante direct ke buffer slow you test koch kar sir. Partly. Selection ye selection bi deni kis sam? Registers ke. Registers the group mark seat of the. Selection ye selection bi multiplexer kis sam? Enable ye enable bi. Register kis sam? Enable output then is some again that will be given for run other run. So enable out, enable B, enable A, selection B, selection A. Right. And finally, we'll be getting GCD output here. Output for this block. Comparator is here only. So in this, the modules in this particular block are uh, here. We'll be having multiplexes. Here we'll be having subtractors. Here I'll be having register, and here I'll be having comparators. All these four blocks will be present inside this particular module. And here, so this is another block which is going to generate. Can I call these signals as control signals, Anucha? Yes. Control signal, Sanocha. Now, what are A and B? These are data inputs, right? A, B, and D, data values. These are not control. This is data. So, finally, this particular block is known as. This is. Data path design and term. Data path design. This is control path design. Control path design. Or controller design. In some textbooks, it will also be given as controller design. Controller and term. So this is a data path. This is control path. So any subsystem will be designed will be having data path and control path. So control path. Ella design niya ali puru. Control path. Ella design niya stam. A input sunai. A a greater than b. A less than b. A equal to b. So decoder in the sense decoder lo that decoder is a combinational circuit, right? Decoder is a combinational circuit, but this controller can't be a combinational circuit. So if the controller is not done, so controller is nothing but a state machine. State machine. Controller is a state machine. So we'll discuss more in the next class. So I have a zero state reset, then S one state, and this the outputs are in each state selection A value, selection B value. These are output values. The input values are greater than, less than, equality, clock condition, etc., etc. S two, S three, and so on. So in this way, any digital system will have two blocks: uh, data path and control path. So data path is nothing but uh, so the main block uh, where the data 
ఇన్పుట్ ఎలా ఫ్లో అవుతుంది అవుట్పుట్ వరకు అది డేటా పార్ట్ సి హియర్ దట్ ఈస్ వాట్ వీ హ్యావ్ సీన్ సో ఇన్పుట్స్ ఇచ్చినాం ఇక్కడ సో వీ హ్యావ్ గివెన్ ద ఇన్పుట్స్ యాజ్ టెన్ అండ్ ఫోర్ సో ద డేటా మొత్తం కూడా ఫ్లో అయిపోయింది మల్టీప్లెక్సెస్ నుండి రిజిస్టర్ నుండి సపరేటర్ కంపారేటర్ అండ్ సో అండ్ సో బట్ ఫర్ ఆల్ దిస్ పర్టికులర్ మల్టీప్లెక్సర్ రిజిస్టర్స్ కంపారేట్ ఐ మీన్ మల్టీప్లెక్సర్ సప్ ఫర్ మల్టీప్లెక్సర్ రిజిస్టర్స్ వీ నీడ్ ఎ కంట్రోల్ సిగ్నల్ కంట్రోల్ సిగ్నల్స్ అన్ని జనరేట్ అవ్వాలి సెలెక్షన్ వాల్యూస్ జనరేట్ అవ్వాలి ఎనేబుల్ వాల్యూస్ జనరేట్ అవ్వాలి క్లాక్ వాల్యూస్ రీసెట్ వాల్యూస్ లోడ్ వాల్యూస్ ఆల్ దిస్ పర్టికులర్ వాల్యూస్ ఆర్ జనరేటెడ్ దోస్ వాల్యూస్ విల్ బి జనరేటెడ్ విత్ ద హెల్ప్ ఆఫ్ ఎ కంట్రోల్ పాత్ దోస్ కంట్రోల్ పాత్ కెన్ బి డిజైన్ విత్ ద హెల్ప్ ఆఫ్ స్టేట్ మెషిన్స్ స్టేట్ మెషిన్స్ డిజైన్ చేస్తుంది రైట్ So we'll discuss more in the next class. So, so meanwhile, I'll be sharing you. Uh, I got one. The PPT equality is available in the, the Googles. You may once browse this. Go through the today's lecture once. and after that if you find any time you may go through this particular pdf also we'll be understanding more things i'll be sharing these two today's class and also this uh, pdf both the things will be shared so please go through this so this will be the final uh, discussion of our topics i mean system design anedi manaku important so whether it is a dld or dsd so final conclusion or the final point is the designing of a digital system so digital system will be designed in this way we'll be having data path and control path data path separate ga untundi control path separate ga untundi for control path we'll be using the state diagram mostly maximum case control path will be designed with the help of state machines why because clockwise manam chustuntam first clock vachina appudu em generate avali second clock vachina appudu em avali third clock vachina appudu em avali so that so data path endante data atla flow avali anedi data path lo untundi right so if you have any doubts you may text me later it's already 7:10 i'll be clarifying your doubts and the further topics will be discussed in the next class so very law code you you need to understand the very law code okay sir very law code ni proper ga chudandi you will be understanding it so don't uh, go for Uh, writing the code for uh, large systems simple code rasi ardham chesukondi the basic fundamentals if you understand the uh, understand the basic fundamentals then you can understand anything a sensitive list lo em rastaru parameters ela rastaru so how to declare inputs how to declare outputs how to convert the algorithm into a simple code avi meek ardham ayipoyan ankonde proper ga then you can understand anything or else you will be getting the doubts like uh, sir binary kela rayali decimal kela rayali so we land the doubts malli start aipothai right thank you i'll be closing the session here thank you